Our solutions for improving the survival of HER2 positive breast cancer patients involves first using a diagnostic assay developed in our laboratory to detect an alteration of HER2 that we refer to as HER2 delta 16 in patient tumors. Why do we think it's important to use a diagnostic assay that can detect HER2 delta 16 in patient tumors? Well, if we compare patients on the left hand side that are HER2 positive but HER2 delta 16 negative to patients on the right hand side that are HER2 delta 16 positive, and we look at these patients when they enter the clinic and we look at the most common negative prognostic factor, and that is metastatic disease. What we find is patients that are HER2 positive, 12% of these patients present with metastatic disease. On the other hand, patients that are HER2 delta 16 positive, almost 90% of these patients present with metastatic disease. We know that metastatic disease in breast cancer is incurable and lethal. Improving the survival of HER2 positive breast cancer patients is one of the most difficult clinical challenges. We have two approaches to improving the survival of these patients. First, we would use a diagnostic assay developed in our laboratory to detect HER2 delta 16 expression in patient tumors. We can then stratify patients. Patients that are HER2 positive should respond to Herceptin. We know that HER2 delta 16 positive tumors are completely resistant to Herceptin and they would require a different type of therapy. And we are currently developing targeted therapeutics that can eliminate HER2 delta 16 expression and activity in patients' tumors. And we believe that by using this HER2 delta 16 targeted therapies, we can improve the survival of HER2 positive breast cancer patients that express this highly lethal form of HER2 referred to as HER2 delta 16.